All right, let's take a flight, shall we, from the Action Sports Jack Studios. All the way across town we go to the campus of Edward Waters University, the oldest HBCU in the state of Florida, and quite a bit different from the last time Google Earth pointed their little satellites on campus. That football field looks a lot better now. Some quick facts on the Tigers. Mentioned the history, established in 1866, and with an enrollment of just over 1,000 students, Edward Waters ready for its jump to NCAA Division II. This year, they enter the Southern Intercollegiate Athletic Conference and continue that transition process. Let's bring in Dan Hicken. He continues our campus tour with a look at EWU. Man, oh man, big things happening at Edward Waters University, and uh, especially when you talk about the athletics. And here to talk more as we continue our on-campus tour, Dr. Paul Bryant. Hey, good, hello. How are not you? the bear. Hey, not the bear. I'm Paul Tiger Bryant. But you have a, he's Paul Tiger Bryant, but you had a, actually a great story, and I want you to tell it because it was awesome. Talk, talk a little bit about, because you worked in Alabama. Right, right. I worked in Tuscaloosa, Alabama. <laughs> I was the uh, athletic director at Stillman College. Right. And I uh, uh, called a pizza company to yeah. try to get a pizza delivered. Yeah. And they said, your name? I said, Paul Bryant. They said, okay, quit playing. What's your name? And I said, Paul Bryant. Yeah. They hung up on me. <laughs> of course. <laughs> so, oh, that's yeah. great. That's great. Well, listen, nobody's hanging up on Edward Waters University right now. No. What a what a wonderful few years it's been. Now, you came in right before COVID I did. and faced some serious challenges right off the rip. Talk about that before we get to all the accomplishments. Yes, came in in 2019. Yeah. And there was a lot of things that were going on, a lot of rebuilding. We had to set the foundation, mm -hmm. and we did that. And, yeah. uh, our president, A. Zachary Faison, mm -hmm. he is one who has a, a grand vision. Right. And so when I came in, the biggest thing was to go from NAI to NCAA. Right. And, and I thought that we would start by where we left off, where they left off. Yeah. Uh, we had to start from the beginning. And oh. so that was a, a daunting task, right. but we did it. Right. We did it. Yes, yes, yes. So that's exciting. So let's start because... We're in Jacksonville, home of the Jaguars, and everybody down here loves football. So let's start with the football program. Give us an update on the football program. Great facilities, things yes. happening, yes. Uh, pointing in the right direction. Talk a little bit about Edward Waters football. So our football program, we were we have been losing for quite some time, mm -hmm. and so we end up uh, changing coaches, mm -hmm. and then we uh, we at the same time we were building a stadium, mm -hmm. and so we have that stadium, new state of the art stadium with uh, turf with uh, uh, coconut husk on the bottom. Right. See, most people have the rubber, right. which is really hot, yeah. but the coconut husk keeps it cool. Ah. So that's what we have uh, and, and our football program this year won four games. That mm -hmm. was as many as we've had uh, won in, uh, since 2018. So, Great. But we hired a coach late. Mm -hmm. We hired him in mm -hmm. May, and so he didn't have a good recruit time to recruit, so now he's recruited, and we're looking forward to an outstanding year this coming year. But you guys aren't just about football. No. Like every time I look up, <laughs> you're winning. I, a, a college world series, a <laughs> national championship is off. So tell me about some of the accomplishments of the sports programs, because obviously your guys vision is not just football, but it's athletics. It, it is athletics. Yeah. And that was the, again, you talk about Dr. A. Yes, Faison, that was one of the things he said. Yeah. We, everyone loves football, mm -hmm. but let's have a total program. We're not just going to focus on a team. We're going to focus on the program mm -hmm. this year. All when I started, we had nothing but two winning seasons or two winning teams. Okay. The whole season. Wow. This year we only have two losing. Not so successful. Not winning. <laughs> <laughs> Very teams. good. Yeah. Very good. Uh, uh, and, and I tell you, uh, our baseball won the World Series. Yeah. They won the NAIA National Championship, then the uh, Black College World Series, yeah. and then our women's softball did the same thing. Yeah, How I mean, great is it that? was phenomenal. But our volleyball team, our women's volleyball mm -hmm. team, they won the uh, the NAIA GCAC Championships mm -hmm. and went on to play in the Nationals. And then our men's volleyball program. Inaugural year mm -hmm. came in and won a co-champions wow. of the of the uh, SIAC. So clearly, uh, uh, fundraising is a big part of it because every time I look, we're having a hey, you got to come out to Edward Waters. <laughs> there's a grand opening of something. You know, there's a new floor. There's a new field. There's a new. Yes. So uh, you guys have done a terrific job with that. Talk a little bit about the challenges that you face and mm -hmm. and the accomplishments that you guys have. The challenges are what everyone thought of us before. Right. And now there's a new day. Yeah. There's a new we emerge eminence. And so with that, we're, we're doing a lot from dorms mm -hmm. to uh, biology labs, mm -hmm. uh, adding new programs. We went from 
Edward Waters College to right. Edward Waters University. Right. And, and uh, I mean, it's just been phenomenal. Mm -hmm. So there's a lot going on. Renovation of all the dorms. Every last dorm is being renovated. Mm -hmm. uh, our student center, we, we're having that. We just signed a deal with Sodexo Magic. Mm -hmm. So we're, our food service is going to be different. And so, again, we're excited to be yeah. uh, where we are today. Yeah. And, and that vision that Dr. Faison has is, is what we're sticking to. All right, I want to talk about the vision that Dr. Faison has because you've mentioned it a couple of times. What is that vision specifically like? How big does he envision the grand plan? You know what? The, the sky, as we say, the sky's the limit. <laughs> yes, sir. But the Emerge Eminence, his thing is he wants to be the best mm -hmm. institution in the land. We're not just talking about in Jacksonville right. or in the state of Florida, in the world. We want everyone to look at Edward Waters University as the institution to attend. Mm -hmm. Well, let's let's be honest. You've made <laughs> leaps and bounds headed that way, so yes. I'm not going to be one of the doubters. Uh, before we wrap up, let's talk a little bit about the football team this year mm -hmm. and, and some of the expectations that come when you say you guys w had four wins last year, so you want to do a little bit better than you did one season ago, I suspect. Y yes, and this year is our first year actually in the SIC Division right. II, okay. NCAA Division II, so we have a great schedule. We're looking to <laughs> Coach, we want to win all the games. Of course we do. But, <laughs> but, but I Not to put you, any pressure on none you. None <laughs> at all. But I tell you, I think we're going to double what we've done last year, which will be a phenomenal uh, opportunity, a phenomenal feat for us. So we're we're excited with the football program Coach Toriano Morgan and his mm -hmm. staff mm -hmm. have done at Edward Waters University. Okay, so I think we've shouted out to all the proper teams, <laughs> but have we missed anybody? I don't want to miss anybody, upset anybody, because Soccer. the pressure's on you. Soccer. Yeah. <laughs> done well. Yeah. This was their inaugural full season. Right. We won six games. That's Great. that's huge. Yeah. Our track. Yeah. Doing well. Okay. And our men's and women's basketball. Okay. Absolutely. <laughs> so they all done well Absolutely. this year. So we're excited. Hey, <laughs> honestly, we joke around, but congratulations, man, and good luck. And we're watching. I mean, it's fun, and you'll continue to grow and grow, and we'll be right there uh, documenting it every step of the way. He's Dr. Paul Tiger Bryant. Don't you <laughs> yes. forget it. Yes. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Action Sports Jacks Primetime, Saturday at 10.30 on Fox 30.